Hello boys and girls. Our story today has to do with our solar system. Help me to sing our planet song again. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. Uh-oh. Boys and girls, did you notice that there is a ninth planet at the end of this line of planets called Pluto? We have to ask a question today. Why is Pluto not considered a planet any longer? When I grew up, there was nine planets in our solar system. Now they're teaching us there's only eight. That's why we haven't been including Pluto in our song. So I found a book today that will help to explain its title, Pluto Visits Earth by Steve Metzger, illustrated by Jared Lee. Let's find out why Pluto is not called a planet anymore. It was a quiet day in the universe when Pluto got the news. Hey, Pluto, shouted Speedy, the space rock, who was racing by with his friends. You're not a planet anymore. What are you talking about? Pluto asked. Astronomers on Earth say you're a dwarf planet, not a real planet. A dwarf planet? Pluto shouted out. Wait a minute. Tell me more. That's the way the comet crumbles, Speedy said. Pluto turned purple with rage. How can this be, he shouted. I'm madder than a Martian. Pluto called out to his three moons. Do I look small? Not to me, big guy, Nick said. Well, you're twice as big as I am, Sharon added. Boys and girls, I didn't know Pluto had three moons. Remember, Earth only has one. Pluto thought, I remember when I was named by Venetia Burney, that nice English girl. There she is. The new planet should be called Pluto. That's a Roman god. A Roman god. Wow. But now this, he yelled, a dwarf planet. Harumph. I'll go visit Earth and demand to be a real planet again. He sounds deflated like the hopeless camel. And with a mighty thrust, Pluto left his orbit and zoomed toward Earth. He asked the other planets to help him out along the way. He saw Neptune in the distance. Halt! Who goes there? Neptune shouted. Friend or UFO? It's me, Pluto. Hi, little buddy, Neptune boomed. Hey, I heard the big news. That's too bad. What brings you here? I'm on my way to Earth, Pluto replied. I want to be a regular planet again. Will you join me? Ah, uh, Sorry, Neptune, Pluto said. I'd love to, but I've got 13 moons to look after. I'm just too busy. Wow, look at all of Neptune's moons. The other planets were no help either. Uranus was too scared. I might get hit by a meteor shower. Saturn was too vain. Did you ever see such beautiful rings? And Jupiter was too bossy. Get out of my way, small fry. So we asked the four gas giant planets. Let's see. Mars was too distracted. Not today. It's Mars Day. The Martians are celebrating. Pluto didn't even bother visiting Venus and Mercury. They were out of his way. Look at the headlines on the newspapers. Small is the new big. Pluto is mad. Pluto put on the brakes at the Mount Baldy Observatory and hovered above the astronomers. Two of them stepped forward. Why did you make me a dwarf planet? Pluto thundered. The astronomers trembled. First of all, Mr. Pluto, astronomer A said in a shaky voice, you are small, much smaller than the other eight planets. So what? Pluto answered. I've still got a big heart. Planets should be much larger than their moons, astronomer B added. You're not. 
I don't care, Pluto said. I liked being one of the nine planets in our solar system. Now nobody will know who I am. Excuse me, a boy shouted. I have something to say. The astronomer stepped back. Pluto, you will always be my favorite, the child said. I will, Pluto said. Small or big, it doesn't matter, the child said. You're the best. Pluto spun around. Well, what do you think of that? I'm special. He looked toward the sun. I'd better get going. It's so hot here that I'm starting to melt. Pluto's not used to being that close to the sun. As Pluto zoomed away, he shouted, Goodbye, Earth. See you around the Milky Way. And there he goes. Boys and girls, I think Pluto was upset at the beginning of the story, but then at the end, I think he felt better. Now see if you can ask mom and dad if they know why Pluto is no longer a planet. You can tell them because astronomers decided planets have to be big and Pluto just wasn't big enough. So they call him now a dwarf planet. Have fun reading and talking and writing about Pluto.